So David Sesse, welcome to Worldstone FC. Uh, tell us how you're feeling at the moment. Um, yeah, no, I feel good. I'm happy to be aboard. Um, can't wait to get out there and start playing, you know. Um, obviously, I've heard, I've, heard, I've heard really good things, so I've got a few, a few um, friends here as well. So, yeah, no, I'm happy to, happy to be on board and yeah, just can't wait to get out there. So tell us, what sort of player can fans expect to see from yourself? Um, I, I um, obviously, uh, full-back, winger, uh, wing-back, <laughs> basically, kind of thing. Um, just, I, I love getting the ball and driving forward, you know. I love um, taking players on, getting crosses in. You know, getting assists, uh, even uh, trying to try to get some goals as well. To be fair, I hopefully I can add that to my game. Um, you know, but obviously, yeah, I like I do like my one on defending as well, stopping crosses as well. I love a slide tackle every now and then. So, you know, yeah. Um, you spent a large chunk of your life in football. You've been in Watford, set up uh, Crawley and Barnet. How much are you looking forward to getting involved in this side? Yeah, and no, obviously I've I know a lot of players that have been here. You know, and um, everyone's always had good things. So, you know, I can't, yeah, it's just, it was, it was bound for me, you know, everyone got a lot of Watford players, former Watford players here, so it was bound for me to come, to come eventually, but, um, now, nah, yeah, honestly, um, yeah, it's, it's, I can't wait to, to get going, um, I've just heard really good things, so. And you've played quite a large number of games for someone your age, um, not just domestically, but also you've represented Sierra Leone, um, do you feel, despite your age, you can bring some experience to the squad? Um, yeah, no, definitely, I think, um, well, I've played, yeah, I've played quite, quite a few. To be fair, I haven't, haven't really checked recently. But um, yeah, now hopefully, I, you know, I bring, I, I can bring something, you know, something to the squad. Um, you know, um, obviously, I know there's going to be quite a few senior lads as well who are going to actually help me as well. Obviously, I'm still learning as well. But um, yeah, now hopefully, yeah, hopefully, I can bring something to the squad. Um, you know, even if it's not just, you know, on the field, maybe off as well. Hopefully, so. And um, you, you're somewhat of a local boy yourself. Um, spoke before about where you grew up. Is a positive of being at a club like this a proximity to where you grew up? Obviously, it's you know not right on the doorstep, but it's somewhat local. Yeah, no, definitely, definitely. Um, you know, I literally I live right next to Harrowmanston, so you know, literally just to, about twenty minutes away to fifteen minutes away, which is good. You know, it's good to um, you know, get in and I can do training and you know I can get home and you know it's always it's always good to be close to home. To be fair, so yeah, no, it's really good to to be somewhere that's local and um, you know it's a club that I know and I, I know of. Quite, quite, quite well. So yeah, that's good to, that's good yeah. to be here. Okay, well, thank you, David. I hope you settle in well. Thank you.